Hello guys, have you heard? We now have a book that will teach you how to cut all these things, how to cut any type of dress you want to cut. The name is the Perfect Dress Cutting Guide. Please make sure you order for yours. So in this particular tutorial, I'm going to be teaching us how to pad a princess that bust here. Yes, we are going to be using a warden. I'm going to be teaching you how to use a warden to pad it carefully. So I want you to make sure you listen carefully and make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like this video. So as you guys already know, the front part of a princess that bust here has three parts. That is the middle and the two sides. So we are going to be showing us how to pad the middle side so as you can see we have our word in place are you seeing it this is our wording so the length from the underboss is actually going to be 10 inches are you seeing it 10 inches you make sure you mark it on the other side the length is going to be 10 inches please if your own boss is smaller than the boss which i'm actually using for this particular project i'm using a bust of 43 that's why i'm using 10 inches if your boss is a little lesser you can use 8 inches or you can use 9 inches i'll try to put the chart in the description box so that you guys will know the boss you are going to use. are you seeing it 10 inches okay for a bust of 43 okay so now all you have to do is please remember we placed it from under the post are you seeing it this is a wording you can use any type of wording you want depending on your reason so now look at it i want you to pin it out make sure you pin it out yes pin it out are you seeing it okay now use your scissors and cut off according to the shape of your center part now lift this one up and cut off that 10 inches please i want you to know that this 10 inches is placed from the under the bust do you guys understand okay remember you actually notched your under bust now look at it this is how it is placed so you now go and iron it out on the ironing table are you saying it so we are done with the front center so let's get done with the sides now look at the side are you saying it okay but we're actually going to be working with the wording okay so take your wording and food like i said guys you can use any wording of your choice you have the soft wording lighter wordings you understand so the thickness of the side is actually going to be from 4 inches to 4.5 inches are you saying it this is the thickness please i would like you to also use your and hold it safe now look at it let me show you guys make sure you adjust it to what you want what i actually want is 4.5 that's what i'm going to be using do you understand if i'm working on a lesser bust I'm, i can also use four inches okay now use your pin and hold it thin are you saying it so the next thing we are going to be doing now is remember please all these things must be uniform remember with the length of the other one was 10 inches this one is actually going to be 10 inches but before we do that we need to first of all mark out a straight line this straight line is going to help us because that place is not actually straight do you guys understand so let's cut it out so as for it to be straight so from there we are going to be measuring 10 inches downward please 10 inches is exactly what you have on the other one so that when you finish coupling your bust there everything is going to rhyme very very well do you understand okay now look at it guys I'm marking out 10 inches are you seeing it okay so when you are done marking it our next thing you need to do is to use your scissors and they cut it out now guys look at it are you seeing it 10 inches here 10 inches yeah both of them has to rhyme okay so let's use our scissors and they cut it out guys please whatever you do for the original material is the same thing you do for your lining just know that although in some cases so many persons will choose to use a different material for their lining some of them choose to use a normal gum stay or a softer wording etc so take your scissors and cut it out so you have it two sides remember the sides are two so now get your side now i want you guys to focus this is what we are going to be doing right now are you saying it just focus okay now place it please the placement is the deal is the big deal are you seeing it place it in a way that this side should be resting at the under boss which you have not then this side should be meeting up to here then the upper side should be meeting up to the edge are you saying it this is how you really do it then after you are done doing that take your pin and hold it firm so that it will not shift while you are drafting okay then the next thing you need to do is to curve it now to curve it is not hard from here to here find the midpoint which here is the middle point now connect it to the under bus point in order to get your curve are you seeing it okay so when you are done doing this then this thing you need to do is to use your scissors and they cut it off do you guys understand that is the next thing you need to do now let's use our scissors to cut it off to actually get the curve but we are not 100 percent done next thing we're actually going to be doing is after here you have to turn it do you guys understand you have to turn it yes now use your scissors and get the final shape look at it guys so many persons also um gum it first before doing this but for the sake of this particular tutorial i would like to do it this way so that you all will understand it and you all will know that it's not hard so losing your pin just remove your pin okay 
and I'm going to be separating it and show us how to place it on each. Please, why placing it on each? Remember that this all this wording has the gum inside. Please make sure the gum inside is resting on the wrong side of the material. Are you seeing it? Okay, now look at it. This is the side that you are going to be using to gum. Are you seeing it? The side that is shiny is the part that's supposed to be resting on top of the wrong side of the fabric. Are you seeing it? Please just know that. So use your pin and hold it. Are you seeing it? So that is exactly how to pad a bust princess that bust here. Are you seeing placing three of them? You now have it. So you now have to go and they couple. Please, guys, like I said, if you love this particular channel or if you love this video, make sure you click on the like button to have access to all our other videos. Like I said, guys, we have a book that will teach you all you need to know on how to cut any type of dress. Please do make sure you acquire yours. The name of the book is The Perfect Dress Cutting Guide. It will teach you a lot. It has 400 pages, 17 chapters. It's just a an affordable fee. Thanks and may God bless you. Don't forget to like this video.